My friends, welcome back. I'm Daily Fix, and we're playing Star Trek New Horizon uh, version 2.2. Uh, I know there's a new Star Wars version out there. It's been there for probably a week right now, uh, but this mod pack is still in version 2.2.4. Like I've stressed for so many times in so many of the videos, I'm stopping to do that. Um, I will tell you the version of of what mod as soon as we're actually playing it. Um, right now we're going to be looking into uh, more of the expense where uh, I wouldn't say struggling a bit with the economy but it could be better. I'm blaming it on the humans. Um, they got really look at the species man it's just it's social and, uh, and amenities. Uh, they, they grow so slow look at the 37 against the Vulcans 31 available. okay maybe maybe it's just me and maybe it's Maybelline anyways let's continue with the uh, event chain of the expanse having followed the chemo side shipment to a nearby system under the enter uh, uh, the enterprise has encountered an Andorian vessel the Kumari on the Commander Sean of the Imperial Guard. Sean offers the Kumari's services to assist the Enterprise, insisting on sending an engineering team to upgrade and repair various systems. Deriding the Vulcan High Command for its lack of support for the United Earth efforts against the Zindi. Captain Jonathan Archer can't help but feel there's more to the Endorian's presence in the Expanse. While the two vessels sit at the edge of the system, their sensors detect a massive energy discharge in the inner asteroid belt as a dwarf planet is vaporized. Holy crap. Further uh, confirm the threat of yet another thing. Uh, we're definitely going to accept. Why wouldn't we? We want to have these people as our friends. So accepting, accepting the Andorian's help pleases Swan. Sharon. Um, whose crew spends the next few days upgrading various systems aboard the Enterprise. Jonathan Archer and Shron devise a plan to capture the prototype weapon by using the Enterprise as bait to lure these in the patrol vessels away uh, before allowing the Kumari to beam the weapon aboard and disarming. The mission, is a success, uh, the mission is successful, however, Shron reveals secret orders to steal the weapon for the Andorian Empire alone. The Enterprise uh, chases the uh, Kumari into the system. The Ultra Cloud? Is that somewhere which I can't see? Ah, uh, that's a bit of a shame, I can't see it. Uh, oh well, what can we do? Um, through it seems the Andorian engineers have triggered the security protocol on the weapon as it triggers an overload of the keramide less laces energy emitters jesus christ um, the kumari is heavily damaged and able to prevent the enterprise beaming back the remains of the weapon or downloading the kumari scans before it manages to limp back in the endurian space what the hell man oh they're going to hate me don't they the bloody overwhelming. I don't like the fact that they are overwhelming. I'm sorry I have to click the Vulcans again. Logic dictates that combat is sometimes necessary. We are not going to be that vassal. Is, is it that bad? Yeah, it's that bad, huh? Hmm, how can we... Well, that we're, we're on Grand Admiral, so it will take me some time to actually get everything back in working order. Meaning we'll have to focus a tiny bit more on some systems. Getting more science would be really nice. We have 150. Um, this is the one that we actually want as well. Uh, so I'm feeling okay to get a few of these systems that are just just in range. Like War 24 4 4 Um also, we need definitely we need to uh, we need the enterprise back to get our fleet back in order. Um, the starbase is now building, so I'm uh, I'm really oh that ain't good. Why are you insulted? That is not good. 
Dus they still hate you Vulcans. <sighs> Damn it. I don't like that. It's, uh, it, it's been going so much different than in uh, other attempts that I had. Let's see, we still need some people over here. We need two more here. A bunch more over there. Oh, here we go. The commercial pack is now broken as well. Uh, I'm hoping they don't go to war. I'm not able to deal with that. Uh, here we go. The expense. Uh, long weeks spent hunting the expense, having have paid off as the Enterprise has successfully captured a shuttle belonging to the Zindi. Uh, prime, a primate scientist leading their uh, weapon uh, project against Earth. A male named Degra. Captain Jonathan Arthur must now decide how to take advantage of uh, his new captive. The tactical officer uh, suggests an elaborate ruse using memory inevitable drugs and a mock uh, shuttle pad to extract the location of the files in the weapons from Degra. But the resources require, required are substantial. An initial. Uh, an. In. Eternal? Initial? Yeah, initial interrogation reveals little beyond the knowledge that the Zindi apparently believe that destroying Earth is their only hope for survival. That's really bad. No, we're going for the deception. Captain John Van Arder, Archer, or, or, uh, orders the uh, construction of a mock shuttle interior. As per the tactical, uh, tactical officer's proposal, using memory inevitable drugs, Captain John Van Archer is able to persuade Degra that the two of them have been prisoners of the Zindi reptilians for several years. Belonging, uh, following the destruction of Earth, and the reptilian sub uh, su subsequent betrayal of the others in the species. Degra re reveals that Zindi were convinced to attack Earth by, by trans-dimensional beings who present themselves as the Zindi saviors. Ah, that, that, this is actually what happens in the series, that's really nice. After a series of fake attacks on the, uh, on the shuttle and a promise by Jonathan Archer to rescue Degra's family, the location of the Zindi weapon is revealed. And Zerti Prime. Prime. The simulation is terminate, uh, terminated and Degra's short term memory wiped. In an attempt to uh, generate sympathy for, his, for their cause, Jonathan Archer has um, then offers Degra and his crew their freedom. Okay, that's something. I don't. I really don't like where this is going. Ah, there you go. Science also. We definitely. Let's start reinforcing the fleet. Uh, the Enterprise um, arrives at the Zateri, um, Azerti system, almost immediately being fired upon by many in the warship patrolling the area. The attacks is soon uh, soon halted though. As a squadron of Zindi primate and Zindi abroad ships form a protective escort around the Enterprise. Oh boy. Intense bursts of communications are detected between various Zindi vessels until, at last, a shuttle docks with the Enterprise and a Zindi primate security detachment offers to escort Captain John Van Archer to the Zindi Council Chambers to present. His case in person. Captain John Van Archer presents the evidence to the Zindi, uh, to the Zindi Council, proving Earth's innocent. Zindi, Zindi fears that Earth would seek to destroy their species and shown to be the fabrication of the trans-dimensional being who themselves have created the subspace instabilities in the um, Delphonic Expanse. To allow the region to become habitable to their kind, uh, for their, for the, to their kind, the primate and arboreal representatives are convinced, with the aquatic demand more time to uh, consider their response. However, the reptilians, the reptilians, and Intersectoids are enraged by this. Oh, that's not good. Seizing control of the weapon, the Repillions and Intersectoids launch the device. Oh my god, here we go. We're going to be attacked again. This time the... Uh, we oh, man. 
uh, form up into one group and attack there. Um, so we, get, we, we are being attacked. Oh, okay, here we go. So the Vulcans, fully repaired Vulcan ship, is coming to our aid. Unfortunately, this time we, we're not receiving help from uh, the Andorians. Uh, we're getting help from the Cindy Primate and Abril. Uh, but still, I was hoping for a tiny, tiny bit more. Anomaly, just research that. Thank you very much. Borders are now closed. Oh, we're going to be losing a bunch, aren't we? Construction complete. Where is my Admiral? Hmm. You. Go here, fight. All of you. Come here and fight, please. Uh, so the Enterprise is now formed, 433 is now the strength. And we have the Vulcans here, it's probably, these are the, no, this is Jonathan Archer. Don't die, mate, we need you. These are the Vulcans then, yeah, the VSS. Silicon life forms, great. Okay, stop here. Um, where do we go? Okay, so you are building, which is nice. You are done. And I want you to go... Wait. Stop. Stop this. Why, why Why? were you going there again? Oh, that's you. No. Survey that. I want this. We do have the other... The others there. So it is okay. Research that. Let's get this one. Uh, let's see what we can do with our very first ascension perk. We got the world shaper, sensor range, we got fleet command limit. Nah, no, we don't need fleet command limit if we cannot raise our naval capacity. Uh, uh, diplomatic core, uh, damage to end game crisis effectors plus 50, opinions increased by 25. This could really work for us. Interstellar dominion. Starbase hull, Starbase capacity, defense platforms, uh, Starbase buildings plus one, research speed, unity from jobs, mind over mana, technology, ascension, edict duration. There's some really nice ones in here. Uh, personally, I would really like to change some opinions because we're really falling behind. Um, and, and this way we could actually be... Like more friendly to everyone. Diplomatic core that plus 525. How will this affect the Andorians? Like it's only like. Once we get out of the uh, 180. We should be very very friendly with them. But it will take us. It's monthly so that's 24 per year. Oh man. It's going to be four, 4 years. Or well, maybe a bit less but still. It's annoying that it happens. Uh, this is all going. The Everything is going up. I, I would like to get more in terms of alloys. We're really behind. I don't like that. I've said that so many times already. Yet I can't change anything about it. Not right now. Oh, please don't die. Oh, he died. Come on, we will make this. Let's let's speed up here. Let's get rid of these. Come on, die already. It's only one thing remaining. Um, a destroyer by the looks of it. Okay, erratic irradiation, a particle um this particular asteroid is an extra solar capture. Is an extra solar capture and appears to have been washed by some kind of exotic radiation as it's plummeting through the interstellar space before finally setting in the yeah it's remarkable very interesting very ooh the expense the Zindi weapon has been destroyed 
Stop that. Um, has been destroyed. The effort of Starfleet cannot be overestimated. The devastation and uh, by the loss of the weapon and their fleet, the Zindi Reptilians and Insectoids have accepted the ultimatum pro uh, pro uh, provided to them by the remaining Zindi species to, uh, for defying the will of the Council. Accepting the ma uh, manipulation into targeting uh, the Earth, the Primates, the Abrosia and the Aquatic have promised to uphold peace between the two powers. Oh, that's nice. It isn't often that the Vulcans offer humanity such overt assistance. Not even uh, the early warnings of these indie plans stirred them into action. The Enterprise rescue of the, um, the, the VSS uh, Serengal from the Expanse changed that. United Earth can only hope. Uh, that the um, Salovey returns. Oh, I know he's going back in in and trying to. Um, how do you say that? Um, uh, trying to uh, get the council like more to back the um, the humans. At least that's what I believe that's going to happen. Anyways, uh, let's build this mining station as well as the research. Uh, you once this is done, I want you to go here, move there. Oh, trade value is very nice, that. So the Vulcans are being, like, like Complete. squished in. Now, no normally, you would be helped by the Endorians. Uh, but apparently, these guys are... They don't like us, but they don't really hate us. We can probably change this. Let's see. Well... It's probably going to change, uh, be a long, long time. They're pathetic in things. Can we, like, offer a trade deal? Will this absolutely... Will this work? I don't know. Will offering them a trade deal actually work into their trust? I, I know it used to work like that, but is it still working like that? Um, we got the Delrillium D deposits, which is nice. We got Magnified Refinering. Um, really nice. Intrusters, of, uh, Impulse Truster. Starbase Hull Points. Advanced war, ha war Hand. Let's go for... No, this is bull. We don't need that just yet. Planetary Shield Generation and Thrusters. Hmm. Engineering station ship. Actually, let's do take this. We are going to take that. It, it is the, the cheapest one there. Uh, why not take it? Um, you guys go heal up. Uh, no upgrades are available, but we are going to be increasing the number of our fleets. Have we encountered a different species, apparently? Let's research that. Strange fluids. Um... Go to. What do we need? Actually, come on, what do we need in the system? Oh, we just need to research that. Okay, that, that's, a, that's a dumbass move on my part. Okay, let's continue. So, wow. That really was fast. A 2k fleet. Man, we're so behind. I don't like the fact. Uh, we're, going, we're definitely going to be focusing a lot more on our fleet. I don't like the fact that these guys, they are superior in fleet power. Um, if this doesn't hurry up, they might be just killing me eventually. And that would be really, really shit for the Federation of, of Earth. Let's get rid of that. Don't care much about that anyways. Um, go into orbit, please. Can we just... What's this? Causes belly? New branch office. Oh, boy. Oh, those... Those bastards. There we go. Crime syndicate has now formed on our planet. Um... 
I think we need to invest in a police station. I don't like it. I really hate it, to be um, honest. Uh, but if we don't, these in the are going to be annoying. Um, does this happen also with Mars? No. And these are not interested either. Okay, that's fine. In terms of population, what do we... Do we actually have different species already? We, we all have humans... New rule of mandates, econo uh, economic mandate fulfilled, so we get some um, unity for that. Let's see, monthly influence plus one, that's really nice. Monthly unity plus ten, also very nice. Um, let's see, what is... What do we want to, to gain? Uh, construct at least two additional um, energy districts. I don't think that's going to be too difficult. So we actually got two or three now. Really would like to get more economic. Definitely. One of three. Eight of ten. He's going to be really backing job once this is done. So we don't have to count on the uh, on Earth to do it. Uh, but I would be interested in uh, actually no, don't go don't don't be too hasty. Let's continue. Um, science ship, you are there. This one's now continuing. Of oh, this one's now done. Let's build a starbase. You are not assigned. That's weird. Well, whatever. Let's take him. Survey. Automatic exploration would be nice, actually. Um, how about you? You are up here. So you also encountered hostiles. Not good. Go there. Science ship is over here doing something, I guess. Don't actually know why you are here in the first place. So he's going to explore up here. Hmm... Let's see, is there anything we can do here? Well, there are a few research anomalies that we can do. So we are going to do those. Yeah, wow. Um, so we finished the expanse today and we uh, we actually got the Azerti system, uh, which uh, is making me quite happy. We're going to be focusing a lot on the, um, on the fleet power because it's really, really below. Um... Uh, after a long time in the depths of space, Captain Morgan has begun to find it hard to recall his original purpose to live uh, in the crew. USS Baron have become the role and routine. Oh! Um, others might aim for this model efficiency. But for Starfleet, the morale and well-being of the crew are paramount. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you would please um, support the series, then I would be uh, definitely, definitely happy about that. As for now, see you next time. Goodbye.